What you're looking at here is an inertial balance. This is the inertial balance lab. The inertial balance has one function, and that's it. It vibrates. Don't pull the inertial balance too far to the side. You could damage it. Part of the lab will require you or ask you to move it to different distances. Just don't push it too extreme. Parts of the lab will have you put clamps on it. Some will have a metal cylinder in it. You will never have both at the same time. Pay attention to the instructions and follow them very carefully. This lab requires you to count how many vibrations are occurring. Think about how fast that can be. You might need to come up with some method that will let you count those vibrations even at those high speeds. Pay attention to the Goldilocks cylinder. It can't be too high. It can't be too low. It's got to be just right. Read the lab carefully for all those special little details. Make sure the string is straight up and down when you have the string attached to the cylinder. Make sure that the clamp is not loose so things don't shift left and right or twist. Read the lab carefully, collect your data, and then it's time for the computer work.